Alright, so it's day four of my maggot experiment, and these guys have really grown since, um, over the past couple of days. Um, as you can see down here, I don't know if these guys are, uh, just about to become flies or whatever. I've never done this experiment, so I've never seen actual maggots or experimented with them, but you can see down here all these, uh, fatter guys that don't move. I don't know if they're... Um, I don't know if they're uh, pupae or I, I, if that's the correct term or not, but all these other little guys up here are crawling around and just absolutely um, going crazy. I guess they're just trying to leave or whatever. But um, the meat is almost entirely gone. Uh, if you look at my first video, I actually packed this jar up with a, a lot of meat and it's almost all gone. So, um... I've actually, there's actually been a lot of uh, other uh, insects attracted here. I don't know what the name of that beetle is, but it is a beetle. And um, there's this smaller insect that looks like a bee. I don't know what that's called. But uh, it uh, this, this actually does not smell bad. It doesn't smell as bad as yesterday. But um, because I what I think might have to contribute to the smell going away is because uh, when maggots are eating, they uh, they their excretions are actually a medis me medicinal, uh, and they uh, they get they kill bacteria. So that's why they use it in maggot therapy to eat that flesh, because all the stuff they excrete uh, kills bacteria. So um, that's actually about it. Uh, I guess, yeah. Bye.